Hi Gemini, welcome or welcome back to my channel. This is going to be your December reading. So um, I did explain in my last video that I'm going to be doing uh, zodiac signs consistently now. Uh, I believe for the month, every zodiac sign is going to get three readings. However, let's go ahead and get into your reading, Gemini. So let's go ahead and start off with the energy. I'm not really getting too many intuitive messages other than Mercury. That's the reason why I did your guys' video first. I kept hearing Mercury. Yes, you are ruled by Mercury. Okay, if you did not know that. This does resonate with all Gemini placements and whatever chart you believe in. Okay, I don't know why I um, felt guided to say that. So, uh, Vedic, Western, Draconic. I'm not really sure how to say it. But, yeah, okay. So, you could be explaining something. Also, before I forget... If you want a holiday reading from me, this is my sale prices. Check the link description below, okay? Okay, so, all right, so I'm hearing something about nosy, okay? So this is going to be the 12th through the 22nd of December, 2022. Nosy. Okay, so somebody could be nosy in your business or there's somebody around you. This could be a Virgo or another Gemini. They want to be in your business or... It's like somebody really wants to be friends with you, okay? So, I'm also getting like your intellect, okay? So, this is why you're going to attract the people you attract, okay? Or, um, it's just, you, you're working heavily with your third house currently, okay? So, check your placements or what rules it. Okay, what is Gemini's vocab card for the dates the 12th through the 22nd spirit? Okay, so we have crystals. Okay, so, and then we have fear. Okay, I'm not sure if something is causing fear. We have crystals. Okay, I'm getting something about a broken crystal, broken necklace. Okay, this could literally be like a diamond, even though a diamond is not actually a crystal. Or something here, you could have um, lost something. Okay, you're going to be able to find something, Gemini. Okay, you could also, this could be spirit also wanting you to buy more crystals, herbs, okay. Um, we have fear, what about long day? We have nervous. Okay, so your nerves. Okay, for some reason, your nerves are a little bad, okay? I feel like you're overthinking something, okay? I feel like, or maybe you need to work with certain crystals during this time, a certain herb, okay, or something that will heal you, okay? You need, you need to buy more crystals or stock up more, or you may lose. I, I'm hearing something about losing something, yeah. Okay, so make sure you keep something in a very tidy place during these dates, okay? But this is just telling me that the overall energy for you is healing. Maybe you're scared of this healing you're going into. Okay, let's go ahead and get a card for the 12th through the 22nd. Let's get an Oracle card. Then I'll get your guys' tarot card. I feel like you're explaining something to somebody. If you did say explain like a very intellectual, let's say highly spiritual conversation or just... I'm just hearing intellect, like, okay, somebody could be scared of your intellect, oddly. All right, the 12th through 22nd, we have the warrior, you could be connecting with the Scorpio, okay, or we have something in depth, okay, like, I'm getting the depths of something, okay, maybe you're coming into contact with something that's very deep or healing, okay, or this could be actual magic if you're working with herbs here gemini okay you're just understanding something you could also be getting a birth chart reading you're, you're, you're going to be doing something in the occultic realm um tarot birth charts okay something you're getting something red or there's something here going on but you're kind of scared of the things that you're hearing okay this could also be this tarot reading as well because it's accurate for some of you guys okay there's nothing to be scared of Okay, I also feel like, yeah, you're going to be connecting with a Scorpio, okay, or a Cancer. Somebody's, like, helping you bring it luck into something when it comes to your spirituality. All right, so this is Gemini. This this is their card for the dates, the 12th through the 22nd, and then I will get into the tarot for the dates, okay? Okay, yeah, we have traditional. All right, we have the Hierophant. All right, we have the Five of Cups. Yeah, so you could be connecting with the Taurus here. Okay, but your overall, this is like structure. Okay, maybe you have to study for something, doing something. I'm also in an honors role. Okay, this could be something you're wanting to do. But with the with the um, Hierophant card coming out, this is telling me that um, something about an institute, okay, or you have to really... You're really learning something, okay? It's like you're, you're learning some form of new information or you're teaching. You're the teacher here. You could be a spiritual guru here, some form of guru, beauty, something like that, okay? Because, like, look at the higher, like, the people listen, okay? You see the people right there? 
All right, so we have direct order, okay, or something from the divine. What's the hierophant? All right, we have the five of wands. Okay, so, okay, so some of the people that you could be explaining something to, or this could be a Taurus, okay, or some somebody um, is low-key competing with you when it comes to something, or um, is arguing with you, okay? Um, yeah, I'm also thinking, like, your nerves, okay? Something about your nerves is that maybe this Taurus makes you nervous, or this could be just somebody who always has a problem when it comes to something you're feeling this about this Taurus here or there's like this conflict okay or maybe this is with this school this company okay this could also be the bank okay maybe you're having trouble with getting a deposit to you okay or something like that okay and you could also just be implementing spell work to enhance something okay not too bad not too bad I'm gonna go in with another deck for you guys okay with the warrior card here I also just feel like intuition okay i'm also getting like something about illusion what is fear what is this before i get into that what is fear I'm actually quite curious what is fear for you guys yeah okay we have the three okay so something is being put on hold or you have to wait for something someone okay this could be a vehicle okay with the chariot card here okay or gemini it's like your nerves are just like i don't want to say bad but like they're like very heightened during this time we did just have a full moon in gemini okay with, yeah the three of cups okay so you could be feeling like maybe somebody has yeah i feel like you you may feel like somebody has somebody else okay if you're dealing with a lover here you could feel this way yeah the nine of cups or you just you have a fear of somebody cheating on you okay if you're, you're in a relationship here or just not just doing something down bad. Yeah, we have the Nine of Cups twice. Nine of Cups here and on the top of the deck right here. Okay, so something about getting something you want or if you're in a relationship with this water sign, this Taurus, they're going to get what they want, okay? Or they they, they like their way. I'm hearing uh, my way or the highway or something. Okay, what's crystals? Before I get into that, let's clarify crystals. So this is a spiritual reading. Yeah. I don't know. I'm also getting like, I'm not, I'm not sure exactly what, a, a crystal ball? Like something about like looking through a crystal ball. Like, you know how like, if some, some people can look at it, like look through the future, okay, or something like that. Maybe somebody could be reading something on you and you can feel it. Okay, however, your ancestors are protecting you. It's really nothing to worry about, Gemini. You're fine, okay? Or maybe you feel like the people who dislike you are watching you. All right, I'm also thinking that, like, if you have this fear, maybe it's because you did, if you could have done something in the past or somebody's here is non-committal, okay? Whether this being you or this person. All right, let's go ahead and get into your seven cards. All right, so show me the week. Um, do I want to use these? You know what? Yeah, let's do it. Let's use these, okay? Actually, no, let's not use them. Let's use this. You just look, I like channeling with these cards better. Okay, I'm also getting like do something you like, okay? This is, doesn't, I don't know, like, if you have Taurus placements in your earth, okay? But it doesn't, it, I mean, actually, it doesn't, it's not too shocking that like you're in your head thinking, okay? So that is saying that you are in your energy, like I said, Gemini's are intellectuals, smart, witty, okay? You're hearing know-it-alls, but I don't really believe that, Gemini. I just think you guys are really smart. Okay, so somebody's complimenting you during these dates. Okay, I don't, don't really see anything really big going on. Okay, except maybe something could be doing the lover's energy coming out. Let's just go ahead and get into the seven cards for you guys, okay? Let's go ahead and see for Gemini. Okay, show me the 12th. Yeah, the 22nd. Why are you pacing around a room, okay? So you could just be thinking or you're over, or maybe you got some form of ticket to somewhere. Either you're going to be nervous or excited about something. It's, that's just that. Like I'm here, I'm seeing someone like jump up and down, okay? Just with excitement. Okay, maybe, maybe you're excited that you're getting this deposit to you, this money. All right, yeah, your money's gonna be given to you, okay? All right, first card we have coming out is the Chariot. Okay, so we actually could have a vehicle here. Let's get the seven cards. All right, we have the Chariot. We have the Knight of Cups. Okay. We have the Five of Swords. Okay, I see. All right. All right, I'm going to say this now. There is an Aquarius evil eye in you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. Okay. 
So what I see here, okay, so I'm uh, starting off on one of these days, this is the 12th to the 22nd. So this is not going to go in a direct order, okay, I'm not going to explain this every time in the readings. Okay, I'm also going to, like, you're kind of done explaining yourself, you're just kind of like, look, it is what it is, I said it the first time. If you're not talking to someone, that's how you know you're really upset or you're really hurt about something, because Gemini's talk. Not being biased here, I just know astrology, okay, guys. Yeah, you know, I'm also getting like cocky, like I feel y'all's energy, like you're like, damn, like I don't know if like someone's teaching you something or you're learning something, but you're like, I already know this. Like, why are you trying to? I feel like someone's trying to one up your knowledge or some shit like that, trying to like tell you you're wrong, and you're like, but I'm not. So like, okay, you can expect that. All right, so we have the chariot. So I see something about a vehicle here, okay, or something about an actual cancer. You're gonna be able to get something that you want, Gemini. I do see that here for you guys. Okay, um, there's going to be a cancer that's going to be helping you out with something. Okay, if you're in the public eye here, okay, um, there is people evil eyeing you online because like you can be looked at as know it all. They talk too much. Okay, I'm also getting like if you make story times or some shit like that. If you're like a YouTuber, so many things you're always trying to attack them. You're always, you're always trying to make a story time about them or something like that. They're always saying the same story. Okay, yeah, this is this Aquarius. Okay, or somebody here. This could also be a Taurus as well. But yeah, with the Five of Swords, I just feel like there is some form of um, envy coming from this air sign, from, coming from an Aquarius. I don't feel like it's you. I feel like it's an Aquarius. I feel like you were being really nice to someone or um, you're being, you, someone's an intellect as well, like you. But you know more information than someone. And this makes them very upset. This Aquarius, this Aquarius wants to be first. But like it's you. It's you, it's you who's chosen it. It's you who knows whatever this information is. You know you're the best at it or one of the best when it comes to knowing this information. Okay, what's the um what's the chariot? What's the chariot here? Alright, so what about the cancer? All right, the page of cups. Okay, so there could be a cancer coming towards you. Okay, this could be offering you a very small offer. Okay, or um, if there's if you had a problem with your vehicle, it's just minor. It's just small. It's not that big. Okay, or if you had something a uh, problem dealing with transportation, it's it's not gonna be a big problem. Something's gonna be able to get fixed in a heartbeat. Okay. Um, I also feel like if you were having a problem with a uh, cancer to be or a Capricorn okay um somebody's just being petty okay this could be you if you have any cancer in you. you could just be feeling petty a little pissy okay i'm hearing someone's like pissy okay this could also be like your child maybe your child could be wetting the bed or something okay one more for the chariot please all right we have the nine of cups okay wow the nine so okay you're getting what you want in a scenario, in a situation, I feel like you love the hate. Like I feel like I feel like it's not. I'm gonna say so much. Hey, I feel like you love when people try to not so much one up your knowledge, but you like hearing other people's opinions. Okay, or you like you like hearing what other people have to say. Like you don't you don't want to like be like you're not like an, if you have Aquarius and you don't get offended, but like you're not like an Aquarius where like they need to be. The most unique they need to be the most different that, that they need to stand out they need to not be like everybody else even though that's in their nature but some people can some aquarius can force that shit let's be honest but what i'm getting here with you is you you like you like hearing other people try to challenge your belief system but this is making this leo this is funny because this is making this leo this Taurus so upset it's not that big of a deal all right so we <laughs> i feel like this how you figure like it's not that big of a deal like it's fine okay i'm gonna write that down for you guys yeah i just feel like something's not that big something's not that deep okay so um you said something to someone this could be a cancer a water sign an aquarius all right uh, they took it very deeply i don't, I don't think you realize this okay or just people are holding on to your words, okay? I'll write it down on another piece of paper. Um, sorry, Gemini. But yeah, because I'm just getting here, Gemini. It's just because you're a very intellectual person, you know, like you 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 fuck with like hearing other people what they have to say it's not on, like some shallow shit okay so yeah okay so you can expect a cancer or a water sign just to be a little petty towards you okay if this is a child or something like that i definitely would go get them checked out i'm hearing that or um 
I don't know if you haven't potty trained your child, okay? Or something here, please watch the people that are watching your child, okay? Because I feel like if, you, if there's an Aquarius, this is a whole different situation. I feel like if this is this Aquarius watching your child, I wouldn't trust them around them, okay? Because somebody's like very envious, jealous of you, the things you have. This could of course be you as well, but I mean, that's like for lower vibrational Geminis. This is a high vibrational group here. All right, so anyways, all right, so you're going to be getting what you want when it comes to something. You're going to be very satisfied, okay, when it comes to this transportation, when it comes to something with this cancer, okay? I also feel like you're going to be able to see eye to eye with someone. Yeah, we have the hermit, okay, because you can trust your discernment, okay? Or you're going to be able to, somebody, like, you help people, you put people on with uh, trusting their discernment, with trusting themselves, okay? We have the nine of cups here. All right, so on one of these dates as well, okay, through the 12th through the 22nd, I'm hearing this could be on the 15th, okay? We have the nine of cups. All right, we have the page of swords. Okay, so you're satisfied. You're doing good. Here's this air sign basically stalking you. I, I, I don't know who this Aquarius is. I don't know if this is an ex or something like that, but it's just quite annoying. All right, so we have, we have the nine of cups and the page of swords. Okay, so somebody is watching you be fulfilled, be happy, okay? But, like, they, like it, it's like a lot of spying going on, okay? So you can expect this, okay? Or you can feel this, okay? Maybe you have a lot of bots, fake accounts watching you. You're just like, okay, what the fuck is it? It's an Aquarius, okay? Or this could be your old friend or something like that, okay? For some reason, they're just very obsessed with you, okay? We have the five of swords. Yeah, the six of cups, okay? So, yeah, oddly enough, I feel like whoever this is, they're going to reach out to you. Okay, they're going to try to reconcile with you. It's gonna be, that's going to be your ultimate. This is going to be your confirmation, Aquarius. Like, uh, that is your confirmation. This person reaching out to you, them trying to talk to you. You're like, okay. Okay, <laughs> I've already been warned. Okay, we have the star. Okay, so I also see um notoriety, fame. Okay, something that you, yeah, the ace of wands. All right, so you're gonna be really happy. Yeah, the ten of cups around about how something does. The star. Okay, if you're posting something, if you, you have a podcast, if you speak, if you write, if you, you you publish something here. Okay, if you have not started that, you should. Okay, because um right now is a very good time, especially with the full moon Gemini. Okay, I feel like there is this form of um. I'm hearing a nuance. That's my nuance, okay? Or something, there's just something new coming to you, okay? When it comes to, um, this could be new followings. This could be uh, more people supporting you. Yeah, the Ace of Wands. All right. I'm actually not going to take the Seven of Cups. This could also be like very Piscean people, okay, as well. Okay, but also whoever this is, I, I just feel like someone's like pissed off at you for some reason. Okay, whoever that, that other, other than like, obviously all this shit is going to be going in your favor, but like there's still that Aquarius or somebody who's like still highly upset about something. Like somebody could be angry about something for what? Yeah, the sun. Okay, so maybe you expose someone, put someone on the spot. Yeah, here's the Aquarius. I think you put someone on the spot and you were like, okay, like what you're saying doesn't really make that much sense. Like it doesn't. This could also be a, a, a cancer, okay? I'm just getting like you, you, you make, it's kind of like when people go to therapy, like when you go to therapy and you kind of like vent about your problems, you kind of sometimes can realize how ridiculous you sound okay you, you make someone feel ridiculous that's that okay but it's because you're right in the situation i'm like literally seeing that all right so we have a full card here okay so you're gonna take some form of leap of faith okay you're going towards something okay new okay so there's a new endeavor you're not going to tell anybody about it that's good yeah we have the will of fortune okay so whatever new endeavor okay whatever you're putting your money into okay this is going to bring great fortune okay yeah we have the five of wands all right however this is like i see like some form of conflict happening yeah the lovers okay so um this could be like moving maybe you're, you're gonna be moving or something like that soon okay or um yeah you, there's a lover okay this could also be you gemini this could be like yeah all right i just feel like somebody like likes to be around you a lot likes to talk to you like someone just loves your voice gemini like someone loves all the shit you say okay all right so we have the three of swords okay so um another one of these days okay i, I definitely do uh see all right the three of swords the queen of cups okay there could also be all right, so I see, I see you hurting about something, Gemini. Okay, we have the Ten of Swords. Okay, either a breakup, okay, could be happening, okay, or something about a Queen of Cups, okay, or, or this water sign. Maybe it's that Cancer that you could be dealing with here. Okay, yeah, we have the Queen of Cups and we have the King of Wands. Okay, so, um, yeah, I feel like there, if you're talking to a water sign woman, they could, they could also be talking to somebody else. You could be figuring out something, okay, or this man here. Okay, you're just figuring out something with three of swords. Okay, but this could also, this doesn't just be love. This could be like your emotions are invested into something. Yeah, the nine of wands. That's why your nerves are bad. Okay, I feel like you have feelings for someone, but you're like trying not to fall too deep, okay, or 
you're yeah that's why that's why you have this fear okay because you can feel like this healing energy with this uh water sign okay but maybe you're not really like dating someone maybe y'all are just talking okay and we're ending it off with the uh five of wands okay all right five of, yeah we have the sun um not the sun excuse me we have the empress okay so yeah with the five of wands energy here i definitely do see um there's this competing going on maybe like with like this beauty or um you just you're just in a very competitive field if this is something dealing with beauty okay or some an artistic ability okay like there, there's just a lot of com competition with women like yeah, we have to, yeah, I feel like you're confused about it. You're like, okay, y'all, like, it's really not that deep. It's not that deep. Okay, we have the, the death, the four of pentacles, and, yeah, the ace of cups. Okay, so, yeah, I just feel like you're going to blossom in a situation. It's really that simple. You're going to blossom in a situation when it comes to these people, okay? Or you're just in this healing energy, okay? Let's go ahead and get um, a future card and end it off with um, the ancients, okay? All right, give me a, a future card. Give me a card. All right, so yeah, we have amazing news coming soon, and we have loved Be The Real You. Okay, so yeah, I'm getting happiness all around. Yeah, period. Okay, so yeah, I mean that like you simply being yourself, you simply speaking your mind, okay? Even if you do, even if you do sound like an asshole, a dick, okay? Sometimes like you, people fuck with this, okay? So keep speaking your truth. That's what spirit wants you to do. All right, let's go ahead and get their ancient card. receive clarity about something so you're gonna receive clarity about um whatever's making you nervous okay don't just take a chill pill okay relax okay i don't know if you actually do take op op opioids or pills okay or herbs i'm just gonna need to work with something but yeah i was literally seeing something about a crystal ball okay so you're gonna re receive some form of clarity when it comes to whatever you need to know okay that's all i have for you gemini thank you so much for tuning in bye